Well, hello there, folks. How are you? It's lovely to see you again as usual. And I say that every time, but I do mean it is lovely to see you. And I hope that you are keeping well as well and managing to get everything that you need for you and your family. So this is just a wee quick look at what I picked up for our food shop this week. And we have gone back to Aldi again. We just can't go over the value, you know, and everything that you do get for the money. And of course, you know, there's always things that you can't get from Aldi or Lidl or I found that anyway. So I've gone to Tesco just for a few bits and bobs as well. So I'll just run you through what I've got and of course show you the receipts as well. But if you're new and it's your first time here, my name's Cheryl. We're a family of four from the west coast of sunny Scotland and it'd be lovely to see you again. So if you do like these kinds of videos, why not consider subscribing just before you go. And if you do like these kinds of videos, please give the video a like just on your way out because it does help the channel and get it out there for more people to see. So in Aldi, we're only £48.91 and wait till you see the amount of stuff that I've got. And then Tesco, it was £18.86. So around about 66 between the two shops for the whole week. So as usual, I got a couple of blocks of butter. So I got a salted butter and an unsalted butter because I'm going to be doing a toffee apple crumble. So I do not I do need unsalted butter for that. And then I got six eggs as as well and then for cheese this week I just got this block of medium cheddar which I'll just grate myself it actually melts better if you grate it yourself some double cream and some creme fraiche I got some of these layered yogurts again they are lovely so I got caramel mango and vanilla I got the raspberry and passion fruit and also just your bog standard strawberry one a couple of pots of the larger mango papaya and passion fruit those are lovely for for herbs I've got some chives some thyme and also some tarragon that's just for a couple of recipes that I'm doing which will be up soon and then a three pack of leeks as well Aldi didn't have any leeks so I had to get them in Morrison's a couple of packs of baby mushrooms as well there aren't many in the pack so I just got two a head of broccoli and then some bananas as well some of these I think I'll need to ripen for a wee while and then some baking potatoes I normally get the McCain you know the frozen ones that are four in the box for £3.50 there are 11 in here and they're £1.19 so brilliant value some Granny Smiths for that apple crumble that I'm doing some vegetable oil some extra virgin olive oil that's handy for salads and things some tomatoes some of this Pearson ding rice which is really nice a couple of things of puff pastry because I'm going to be doing cheese ham and leek pasties or pasties as well some pesto sauce pasties pasties <laughs> And then some fresh tagliatelle for a pasta that I'm going to be doing. And then these chicken thighs, I'm going to be doing a sort of creamy chicken stew with mashed potato on top. A kind of pie. So I'll use the chicken thighs just for a wee change. Some hot chocolate, some bread flour. And then Aldi's version of Weetabix, which Mr. What's for Tea said are actually pretty decent. I don't eat them, but he said, you know, they're pretty good. A couple of packs of ham chunks for the pasties that I'm going to be doing with the chicken and leeks. And then some garlic bread. I got the round one just for a wee change. A whole cooked chicken. That's for the pasties as well. And then a lemon swiss roll this is lovely with custard and then i got a 12 pack of sparkling no this is still water i meant to pick up the sparkling never mind excellent value as well for those a bag of chips just for the freezer and then i got some flushable wipes these are a pound off if you've got the tesco club card which we have and then a couple of kitchen rolls as well and that's everything that i got from aldi and tesco like i said i'm going to be doing a toffee apple crumble i'm also going to show you how to do instant butter using one ingredient i'm going to be doing a loaded baked potato bake and a chicken and leek ham you know the wee pasty pasty things as well so those are all coming up but just before i move on i wanted to say as usual a huge thank you to the supporters of the channel over my patreon page and to the channel members here on youtube as well and i do need to update that so i will get on to that in the next few days and for you all for watching and leaving your lovely 
comments. Everything is very much appreciated. For those who share the videos as well, you know, that's absolutely fantastic. Thank you so much. And I will catch up with you during the week. I think I'll be back on Sunday for Meals of the Week, which is my favourite time of the week on the channel. You know, so many of you love to watch them and I love putting them up as well. And if you're not following me on Instagram yet, I'm What's for T3 over there and it would be lovely to see you there as well. So until I see you next, mind to take care of yourselves and I'll catch you off as soon back here on What's for Tea. Bye now.